You smell that, boys and girls? It smells like harvest time. Let's get to it. So, even though I'm looking at the corn, corn isn't ready yet. It's still a little bit away. So, we still have... Yep, still needs a little bit. It's still producing its ear. A little wet still. Let's get in our bobcat. Dealer. Felt sorry that he uh, gave us a bad grain cart last time, so... He gave us a good deal on a new ones. Or a used one, I should say, new to us. We're gonna go pick that up quickly. I'm hoping I can pick it up with Squad's truck here. So, I know this is only a three quarter ton truck, but I think I can at least pull this grain cart a short way so we pulled it out front here for us this is definitely a used grain cart which is all right I'm hoping this one works good back up here need a rear view camera hook that up there it's not too bad got a little bit of squat. It's probably should have a lot more squat. It must be really balanced, but it doesn't appear so. So, somehow this foreign grain cart got over to the states and we're still going to use it. So, that's why you don't see many of these, but it's a good little old grain cart we got for a great deal. We only paid uh, 4,000 for it, so to me, that's a good deal. Especially, it's not too wore out, even though it's age. I have no idea the age of it, though. We'll have to pull this slowly. Doesn't appear that it's pulling it too bad. It's definitely a little wide. The whole tire sticks on the outside of the, the truck here. Yep, just a little wide for this truck. Pulling out over here. Definitely should put the blinkers on. We'll take it kind of slow going back here. Pulling over here into our gate. Everything looked like it made it pretty well. Turn our blinkers off now. Let's try to stay away from the bushes. Woo! Got a break after that little hill. around over here so we're just gonna leave it uh, parked over here to the side unhook this here there we go we'll park this over to the side I think we're gonna hook up the international to it I don't know. We'll see how the international starts. So we've got the international started. That's a good sign. Hold over here. See if we can get this hooked up. Open everything hooks up properly. I think we're close enough. We will see. Got a 
gotta hook up the PTO. There we go, got the PTO hooked up. Let's see if everything works good. Everything doesn't look too bad. It does seem like the front is right and a little low. I'm surprised the back tires ain't backwards. But oh well. So we are going to take this over to our field. So we're going to harvest the, or at least try to harvest the soybeans today. I think they'll go, but we're going to go check them. Alright, so we got the international over here. So now we need to go back and get our combine. Don't have a ride, so we got to walk back. That's good, our combine started up. Raises a header here. Don't know if anything's in our way or not. We do have a tractor over here to the side. Currently can't see. I think we're good. We'll miss the 1066 over there sure we don't hit anything. All right. Head over here. Let's get to the field. So I'm actually going to we got our uh Massey Ferguson 620 resurrected. So basically uh it's been we haven't used that in probably 10 years. But we got to go greased up. It's going to be running. Uh, the only issue is I'm not going to take it over to the field just yet. Because I want to make sure the beans are ready to go before I take that over to the field. It's a little bit slower of a combine, obviously. It doesn't have a cab. So, don't want to have to drive it back if the beans aren't ready. This head ain't that wide, but it's wide enough to have to go around a few signs and everything. Alright. Got another sign over here. We're going to have to slow it down. We've got a lot of signs go around. This is a downward slope here, so then we have a water crossing. We're gonna have to take nice and easy. Slow down. Don't want any water getting into the intake. No problem here for our John Deere. I'm not sure which field we're going to start on. I think I'm going to start over here on the field beside our grain cart. I fit in between here? Uh, I don't think I can. I'm going to have to go in front of the grain cart. Little girl started, so it looks like the crops are a little bit too wet still. Well, all right, guys. So yesterday the crops were too wet to harvest still, so we had to wait. So waited a whole day. We're gonna go see if they're ready right now. Drive right this truck over there. We just left the combine over at the field, so go down there and check the moisture levels and then see if it's ready to go. Then we'll bring the whole crew over if it is. Grease our combine up and get to harvesting. Alright, so we're all greased up, ready. Let's see if we can uh, 
lower the head here start it up see if it's good to go so it looks like it's flowing good everything looks like it's going really good Let's see how the grain sample is so the grain sample looks really good looks like we're able to harvest so with that said let's get the crew over so we're over here in the weed row got our Massey Ferguson here we put a new uh, fire extinguisher on there just in case it's old combine so let's get this thing let's see if it starts uh, started on the first try Wow Oh, yeah. Now it's... Can we get it out of here without damaging the paint too much? Alright, we got it out of here. Now we got the uh, venture of getting it around these bushes. Around our feedlot here. Ooh. Not a smooth area, that's for sure. Ooh. A little bumpy. Let's get this to the field. Alright, so we're gonna see if this old girl starts up. Wow. Starts up nicely. Uh oh. Got a harvester here. So that was really fun riding this combine. A little old time feel there. Get this auger pulled out. Put this in there. So we're just going to do the first round. Because basically we need to get this thing out of the way of the new combine. It's harvest time. We can't be messing around. But it was fun running this whole thing. So definitely a venture. Swing that back in. I'm gonna park this over here so it stays out of the way. All right. Well, that's going around. We need to head back. We need to move the auger to a new bin so we can uh, unload these soybeans. So we'll go get back and do that. Jump in our truck here. Head on down. I'm gonna have to try to stay in front of the combine so we can't mess around at all. Alright, so we need to move it from that grain bin. So that grain bin has some oats in it still. And we gotta move it to. Make sure I got my grain bins right to this grain bin. I'm gonna put soybeans in that grain bin. So you guys probably didn't see I got this uh, 7030 diesel, good old tractor. I have to say, see if this old putt putt starts up. 
Yep, it did. So we're moving this auger over here. So I'd like to put it over here someplace. Not exactly sure where I want it. Got to be very careful when it's so high up like that. Don't want to tip it over. got that in position. Everything looks good. Shut this old putt-putt off. Get back to the harvester. See you there. So we're just pulling back there. Looks like the combine's going around there. You're gonna have to go on film. He's pretty full. Get over here to our grain cart quickly. Start this grain cart up. Try to unload this combine. All right, got our first load unloaded. Combine's ready for un another un unload. Get over there. There we go. Now we just have to get this over to the truck. It's a heavy load for this old 1586. Starting to like this 1586. Get this unloaded into the truck, and then we gotta take that truck back to the grain bin. Start this old truck up, and I'll see you back at the grain bin. Pull over here to the grain bin. I'll back this truck up closely here. This is that power pull. Try not to get it into the street. There we go. There we go. Start this old John Deere up. There we go. Unloading into the auger. Wait until that grain gets all the way up. Looks like we're good. 
shut this John Deere off. And back to the field we go. So we're gonna pull this truck around the other way just so we don't have to turn around with a full load on. The truck doesn't have the best turning radius. Got to back up a little bit. There we go. Let's get this uh, old tractor. Looks like our combine's already ready to unload made it back just in time. Beans, it's bean harvest. We can ride along in the combine a little bit here. Gear. Come on, old girl, you can do it. You're international. It's like we didn't catch our combine, but run over there quickly. This will probably top off this grain cart. Go. Yep. We're completely full now. Got about 570 bushels. So now we're really lugging. Pulling up this little uh, hill. Come on, girl. You can do it. You can do it. Come on. go. Might be slightly overheating the engine, but we got it up that hill. Good thing is, is this tractor doesn't have to work very hard, beans. it's just bean harvest. We probably should park the truck closer over here, but it won't be very long and that combine will be done with that field. along. I think we'll just go up this road here. There we go. Now we can make some good time. Get this uh, auger folded out here. Well, that's a little quick unload. So, just about got all the grain cart into that truck. Alright, unloaded the combine. It looks like it's going there. Going pretty good. It's not going to be too long. We're going to be done. Looks like we'll get both of these fields done today. Got another load of beans here. Probably get a couple more before we're done. And another load of beans here.
Uh oh. It's like we bumped our auger slightly. Line back up with the truck. There we go. Unload. And shut off the tractor. So we are just finishing up here. So it's getting a little tough, but we just have a little bit left of this field. Don't really have that much. So I figured I'm going to push through, try to get it done. Boy, is it getting tough. Got to go nice and slow around here. So we got fairly good yield off of these fields. I would say probably a tad bit unrealistic, but that is okay with me because we need the money. I think we won't quite get another half load in our truck, but still made great yield off this. Now this is our last sliver. Shut the combine off here. Unfold the auger. So we only got like 30 bushels in there, so basically we don't have much. I think we're going to leave the combine at the field just because it's getting late tonight. Park this old girl over here by the grain cart. Alright guys, thanks for watching this beautiful day in autumn on Autumn Oaks. And I will see you later thank you all for watching like comment and share and subscribe see you next time